Good morning, my TikTokers and my Tubies. Today is May 8th. It is my daughter's birthday, or better yet, it's the day that she was born. And I want to read the Proverbs for today. It's Sunday. I don't usually do Sundays, but I'll do it today considering it's the day she was born. It speaks of wisdom, the good woman. Wisdom is always associated with being a female. Now, verse three says, she is near the entrance to the city, calling from the gates. It's talking about wisdom and being wise. You who are ignorant, learn to be wise. You who are foolish, get some common sense. Verse nine, these things are clear to any intelligent person. They are right to anyone with knowledge. Here it says, wisdom is better than pearls and nothing you desire compares with her. I have good advice and common sense to offer. I have understanding and power. Speaking about wisdom, I love those who love me and those who look for me will find me. And then we're moving down to what other verse? 32 says, now, children, listen to me. If you follow my ways, you will be happy too. Listen to my teaching and what? And be wise. Don't ignore what I say. Okay. And that's the final verses that I took from um, Proverbs chapter 8 on May 8th. Again, the day my daughter brought me the greatest joy. That was one of the most joyous days of my life. I love her. She is such a treasure. She's going through her little ups and downs, just like all humans do, but she's a tough cookie, honey. She was cut from the tough, the tough quilt. She's resilient. She's awesome. I wish you could see her. She's beautiful. She's stunning. She's absolutely stunning. Anyway, I keep her in my prayers always, as I know she, she prays for me, and she, I know she loves me very, very much. You know, we just have things that we have to work through in life. And that's just called being human, uh, imperfect. And it, 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 it doesn't change my love. I love her. I care for her. And I want her to always know that. And always keep in mind what the Bible says to always be wise, my child. Be wise, my child. That's what make God's heart rejoice. So if someone is asking you to do something and it's not a wise choice or a wise decision, you have to let this scripture supersede all the other scriptures. You just have to follow what the Bible teaches you at Proverbs chapter eight and be wise.